start. This is analog digital trainer. Very useful in digital electronics lab and electronics lab useful for analog basic experiments, analog and digital. This is top board. Here, this is 0 to minus 12 variable power supply isolated. This is 0 to 12 volt variable power supply. This is common, this is output. These are fixed power supplies ground, 5 volt, minus 12 volt, plus 12 volt. This is ZF socket, 20 pin, useful to check the ICs. All 20 pins is connected to extended by BS5 sockets. This is potentiometer 1K. This is potentiometer 1 mega ohm. This is speaker output. This is volume control for audio amplifier. This is 0 plus 12 minus 12 AC supply. This is DTFFG2 red set portion of the master unit. This is two seven segment BC to seven segment. A1, B1, C1, D is the first seven, uh, left side seven segment display. A2, B2, C2, D2 is the right side seven segment display. This is LED bar graph. It is 0 to uh, 4 volt. If you short, it will come 2.5 volt range. This is DPM, three and of, two and a half digit. Uh, left side 200 volt range, right side 200 milliampere range. This is output uh, uh, positive and this is negative. This is power on LED. This is function generator output. Sine, triangular, square. This is amplitude control and this is frequency control. This is a function of selection of uh, sine, square, triangle. Sine is center. Square is bottom side, triangular is top portion. This is frequency selector switch of different ranges, six ranges. So you can select any range depends on your requirement. This is breadboard panel, easily removable panel. You can per, uh, perform experiments on breadboard or ready made experiment boards also. You can insert. like digital IC trainer 2, digital IC trainer 1, you can insert in this way. So ready made we have panels of 40 panels, ready made circuit panels also we have or you can perform experiments on bad board, depending on your choice. This is DIO2, this is logic indicator come data switches, here 15 switches are there, upper position is high, lower position is low, 15 data switches, you can use it at a time, this is push button switches to give the pulses, two push button switches and logic indicator high low you can uh, give the logic probe you can see the LEDs position and these are four clock generators one is one heads 
फाइव हेड्स हंड्रेड हेड्स वन किलो हेड्स कनेक्ट मेन स्कॉट बैक साइड ऑफ द ट्रेनर मेक इट ऑन दिस इज पॉर ऑन एलईडी विल ग्लो LED, you can see the LED is positioned by logic indicator switches. Depend on the LED with on off. High, top position is high condition. Lower position is L means zero condition. You can give the logic probe logic probe to any pulsar output. You can see the logic probe LED. Hi, when the press, it will come. High LED will glow. When the release position, low green LED will glow. This is for A bar. For A, normally red LED will glow. When push button give, it is green LED will glow. This is A. Same way, the other push button B bar. If you, by default green LED will glow, after push button red LED will glow. Same way B. Re by default. Red LED will glow after pressing. Green LED will glow. These are two push button switches. This is clock generator. Connect CRO ground is here ground. Connect. CRO positive 1 kilohertz you can see observe frequency 1 kilohertz on CRO like that you can check the frequency 100 hertz 5 hertz 1 hertz this is one method you can check directly logic probe to one hertz the leds will glow if one one hertz slowly leds green led red led will glow with uh, some duration according to the one hertz if you give five hertz it will glow very fastly Speedily, green LED and red LED will glow. But if you give 100 hertz, you cannot find out LEDs. The in high speed LEDs are glow. You cannot visible. Okay. To check the TTL and CMOS switch. Put uh, put TTL switch at TTL mode in downward down downward position. Connect ground to top board of the positive 12 volt, 0 to 12 volt ground, and positive to logic probe. Connect multimeter with 2 volt range, 20 volt 2 volt to 20 volt range. Connected. positive and negative across the power supply check the led position in ttl mode after 0.7 volt tri state will come
of 0.69 the LED green LED will be off see here when the green LED will off condition to check the voltage on DMM is 0.7 volt this is TTL voltage of 